Touch him off. There you go. This is what you get for crawling too close to my settlement, bitch. <laughs> Hi guys, it's Anamite and welcome back to Down of Men. I've made a mistake in the previous episode. I'm very sorry. Probably because of my accent. It sounded that I say Down of Men. No, it's Down of Man. Not eat, man eat. Uh, okay, whatever. Forget. I'm, 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 I'm deep. <laughs> I'm digging myself deeper. All right. I know. I made a mistake. So, uh, last time we've made like a little settlement over here. It's so pretty. And now we have to actually uh, dry some food before winter is gonna come. So let's actually do so, right? So we have to build. According to this thing over here, I have to build a food dryer, and then I need to place a storage tent. Okay, that sounds nice. So I won't want to build it probably next to the river because reasons. Storage tent. A tent to store and preserve resources. Wood pile. Rock pile. So we have those two things over here. Hay sack. Okay. No idea what this thing is. Storage hut. Uh, granary. And warehouse. Okay, that sounds very nice. But we do actually have those things for... Oh, a place to store flint, stone and ore. So... It's those things. Wood pile is a place to store sticks and logs. Okay, so we have those two things actually here. Right. It goes a little bit better than I thought, actually, you know? <laughs> okay, so where I would like to build this thing, huh? Hmm, maybe... Maybe here. A little bit here. Okay, let's place it here. And now, production. Okay, food dryer. So let's get this thing, and I would like to place this... Maybe like this. Is it a good idea? Or maybe like this? Let's build you... Okay, I can make like a small passage between those two buildings. So let's make something like this. There you go. It looks nice. And they're already building this thing. Okay, hold on. Slow down the game. <laughs> wow. Storage tent. The building process. What do you need for this thing? Oh, we just need sticks. Okay. You have like lots of sticks over there. So that should not be a problem. I don't know... I don't understand why the tents are holding bones. Rough fish. So this is like the supplies within this tent, right? So why you hold... Okay. Rough fish I can understand. Wooden spear, okay. The tool, all right. Clothing, all right. But why are you holding bones and rough skin in the house? I, I don't understand this thing. Should I actually like understand this thing? I hope not. <laughs> I don't care. Okay, the tent is ready. This slot can contain up to 10 items of the same type. And you can hold 12 different items of plenty over here. That's nice. Let me start to store something here. Yeah, bones. Oh, very good. Okay, so you'll be able to take out the bones. So actually the houses can act as a temporary storage thingy? That's nice, I guess. I don't know. Okay, you still need to build this thing. Right. Start chopping down. I mean building. <laughs> cannot, too bad I cannot zoom like closer, you know, so we're gonna have like a better idea what exactly they are doing. But I think this is still like enough. Like this is okay. Uh, if you're gonna try to build more tents, I think I'm gonna build the tents on this side. Like one here and one here. Later on as the game will progress. We have a new river nearby. This guy is fishing. Okay, there's a bunch of fish over here. This one does not have fish anymore. Okay, so maybe... Can I move this thing? I don't think so. Okay, I would like to block this area from getting fished out. So we actually want to run out of fishes. Is that like even possible? How to say. Uh, first construction, food dryer, knowledge plus one. Aha! Meat that has been corded lasts for a long time. Okay, so food can actually spoil in this game. Okay, good to know. And you can uh, dry out both meat and fish on this one. Oh, I've I've fished up ten fish as well. That's nice. That's very good. <laughs> oh, I already see fishes over here. Nice! Okay, so I'm gonna... Okay, I can actually like block certain resources. So, you know, just so that our meat won't taste like fish, we're gonna hold fish here and then we're gonna hold meat here. And also, I'll have more or less of a, like an idea what is on which stack, right? Okay, you put it meat over here because I probably forgot to take it off, but that's that's okay. I like how children in this game are not completely useless piece of shit. They actually try to. Oh, wait, they have two children. Hey, that's so sweet. Oh, my population is growing. I did not. Sad that I have already two kids. Oh, that's so sweet. Uh, okay, block the fishes here. There you go. Okay, so fish are dried over here. Meat will be dried on the other one. That's very good, I guess. 
A very perfecto. <laughs> Remember to always dry your food and keep it in a storage structure to preserve it for as long time as possible. Let's have some. Okay. In every, if everyone is well fed and taken care of, you'll set them to reach a high level of welfare and prestige, and more people want to join it. For new people to join the village, you have to build enough residents. Okay. So the time has come to build that thing, of course. Right. So we have different houses as well. We have a tent, a basic shelter, a hut. Uh, stables. Oh, this for goats? And a roundhouse. Hmm. Okay, so now we have this thing. So let's see. Ah! Okay, and apparently... Right, so if you build those type of structures, you can only rotate it two times, right? So it's either north, south, east, west. And apparently the tent is different. It has in total like eight rotations. That's nice. Okay, so... Let's see, I would like to build a tent... Uh, okay, I would like to build a tent maybe here. And then I would like to build another tent. And rotate it. Like... Oh shit, I wanted to build one over there. Here. There we go. That's nice. Look at that, they're actually building the tent. <laughs> okay, let's speed up this thing a little bit. So we're gonna put like those things around. Oh, there you go. Oh, I've uh, I've tried uh, 10 skins. That's so nice. And I got additional knowledge point. There you go. Very nice. <laughs> this is what I call a proper tent, guys. This is this is like a proper tent. There you go. Wait for you people. New humans will join your settlement. Know that your settlement can also grow when your people reproduce. This plays a more important role when you reach larger populations, as you can have a larger number of births. Yeah, you don't say. Well done. Uh, you now have the basics to how to run a settlement. Note that there are quite a few other mechanics in the game that are not explained here. Okay. Can I finally play on my own? That was a fucking tutorial. Ah! Okay, so there we have like a proper thing. I did not notice that I actually picked the tutorial in the previous one. Right, so we have challenges. Okay, you have to unlock three most milestones. Scenarios, community. Okay, aha! Okay, so we have certain things here to be done. We have to get hunting and gathering, accumulate three units of rough meat, okay. Survive two years. Humble beginnings, unlock the Neolithic era. Get 20 people in your settlement. Unlock all Neolithic founder crops, okay. Get 10 domestic animals. Build stone circle. Unlock bronze age. And then we can actually like, go to the Northlands and ancient wars, available soon. Well, well, oh, really now? Okay, does it actually matter on which set I'm gonna go? Leg side sounds nice. Hmm, okay, I would like to go over there. Location, game mode, normal, unlimited save games, other tribes match your technology, game can be paused. Hardcore, only one save, other tribes progress on their own rate. Normal. Okay, for now I want to go with normal, actually. <laughs> So this is the thing I did not know, that that was a tutorial. I should have probably read the description on a mission when I accept one before actually getting too excited. But okay, whatever. We have a lake over here with some fishing grounds, which is nice. Okay. Right, so is this like a good idea to build like a, like a settlement? Yeah, it should be fine. Sure, sure. So I have to build exactly the same things I had that done in the previous time. Okay, that should not be a problem. So... Let's actually get into building. So fishing could be required first. There we go. Uh, okay, one person can actually do this thing. What? Ooh, what's this? Spiritual. School pole. A structure in memory of the dead. Okay, totem. Men here. Dolem. And stone cycle. Oh, so that's where we get that thing. Okay. All right. So quite basic stuff, you know. Okay, I've noticed the first difficulty. We are lacking. Uh, uh, pile to keep up the stones. I'm gonna build like a pile over there. There you go. Okay, sticks will be gathered from that side. Let's see. I need to look for flint. Obtain flint. Okay. We don't have flints. Of oh, we have some flints over here. How many? Ten. Hmm. That's not much. But for now, it's it needs to be like enough. So obtain flint. There you go. Okay, can we get some... Okay, what's this? Ah, berries. Okay. 
So I'd like to gather the berries as well. There we go. Okay, anything else I could try to gather? Let's see. Obtain stone. Hmm. Stone, okay, that's nice, but this is not flint. Can I actually find some flint around? Let's see, animals. Ooh, cave bear. All right, stay away from that thing, that's for sure. We have some flint over there. Uh, some more sticks over here. Oh, getting flint over here is gonna be a problem. God damn it. So also I'm gonna build exactly the same things I have learned uh, in the tutorial, right? So the crafting, crafter will be over there. Do I have skins? Rough skin. Hold on a second, I don't have dry, dry skin? Ooh, okay, game. You want to play this way? Fine, fine. Get out of my sight, skin dryer, crafter. Okay, I need to build the storage tent. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna start building this thing, but I actually think I can pause the production. So I won't have to build it like immediately, right? Hope. So make this thing here. Cancel construction, set high priority. Hmm, I cannot cancel it exactly. But okay, that's that's fine. We can actually do this. Okay, so the skin dryer is gonna be placed here. Like far away from the actual settlement, so let's do something like this again. Okay, sticks will be gathered from there. Mega leaf. Mega leaf. Oh, so this is for the spiritual thingy. Okay, the lack of flint actually scares me a little tiny bit. We have some more flint over here actually. Then, yeah, and this g cave beard actually scares me as well. <laughs> it's something I would not like to face, you know. At least not now. And we got our first knowledge point. Okay. Oh, this thing requires five knowledge points. Oh, screw you, game! Dog domestication, knowledge. Go domestication, dog. Taining. Spirituality. Totem megaliths. Composing tools. Yeah, I think I'll need this thing. Flint, spear, axe and pick. Okay, well, food dryer is the first thing we need to get because, you know, seasons and whatever. We have spring country. There's a gigantic bear going towards my camp. Oh, no! Run! <laughs> oh, what the hell? Uh, there's a bunch of bears around. Holy shit! Okay, the bears are gonna be a problem. I just hope that the animals reproduce. Oh, he bloody mauled that poor deer like he was nothing. Holy shit. <laughs> so I think that the bears should be the first target of, of mine, of my people, right? Okay, 200 uh, health for the young one. There's a young one, another one over here, 200. And the adult one has 360. Oh my god. Okay, I think I will need like three hunters maybe. So three, maybe even four. Make two of those. And do I have some... Wait, do I have actually the harpoons to f find the fish? Wait, oh, I already had this thing. I already had the crafter. Oh my god, I'm so blind. Oh well, nothing you can do. Uh, let's make some, some uh, harpoons over there. Right. Should nice. You should be nice. And the flint I had over here. Uh, work area exhausted obtain flint. So we have no longer flint over there. Right, so the next fl flint deposit is over there in the mountain and also I think I still have like a flint over here Yeah, so we have like 10 over here that we can pick up from the ground. All right Cave bear old female. Oh, we can actually hunt this one. Okay. How many spears do I have? I should have I think two Apparently I have six. Okay, so let's try to wow. Oh, that's a cow. Okay. Let's try to hunt this one how many people will go out and hunt the mighty bear? Gather your weapons, warriors. Tonight, we hunt. You serious? You sent one guy? I mean, one female to hunt down the bear? Oh, this is not gonna end good. Just as I thought. Run! Run, 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 run. Why you have attacked? Oh, crap. Okay, guys, get over there. Oh, you almost died. Okay, you retreat back to the tent. Right. Every single adult there is. Oh, there's only one. Uh oh. Well, that's just great. Oh, it was way easier on the tutorial, you know. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. That's not good. Cave Beer has escaped. 
Uh, yeah, exactly the thing I wanted to achieve. Using my sixth sense, I found out the better location. We are hunting it again. Hunters are going between the bushes. Uh, actually, you know what? Hold on a second. I need to slow down the game. Oh, there's no slow down. <laughs> that's great. Okay. Uh, okay. You have two wooden spears. That's great. Hunt this guy. No, 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 no. You go hunt this guy, and you're gonna go as backup. Even though that you're low health, you can still do the same amount of damage, right? All that. Hunt it down. Go, warriors. Go around in circles. We are not going around in circles. Oh, that's bad. Okay. Okay, good, 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 good. Run away. Run away. Actually, you know what? Forget about it. Ha! <laughs> You're dead, boy. What you gonna do now? Uh, where are you going? No idea. Okay, this one needs to retreat back to the house. Actually, funny thing. Apparently, this is a bug, but if you're gonna order him her to run, she runs normally. When she tries to walk, because she's hurted, then she won't try to walk normally. Okay, gather the meat from this thing. And we got some meat, we got some skins, and we basically limited the population of bears. Very good. And now it's actually time to make the food dryer. There we go. Alright, so food dryer unlocked. Let's see. Food dryer. Okay, I would like to have, please, two over here. One and second. Sweet. Okay, the food dryers are ready. The storage tent is ready as well, which is very enough. Some. Now, can we hunt? More, oh, I don't know exactly how they're gonna react if I'm gonna try to attack one of those three. So, for now I need to get more hunters, okay? However, I think... I saw something else we could try to hunt for the beginning, right? Okay, there's another bear over there. This entire place is lured with bears, what's this thing? Okay, like a goat thing, whatever. Uh, okay, we have a boar over here, so let's try to hunt this one guy. Uh, the bears terrify me. Adult bear, 360. The young ones are not a problem, but the big one is gonna be a issue. Because the old one had like 270 hit points. Oh, and this one has like way more uh, without having like maybe five hunters and probably risking that somebody's gonna die. I'm not even going near of that bear. Not in a million years. Yeah, they definitely go as a pack. Because the adult female is over here, and they, the small ones, actually ventured into my village, and now they're going to the bigger ones. So, I'm guessing that this is the game mechanic. If you're gonna attack one of them, then uh, all of three will attack you, so that's not even a plan. The boar have escaped. Where? Oh, seriously? He ran away. Oh my god, my hunters are the. Oh! Well, hello there. How are you doing? Wild donkey. Okay, how about we're gonna try to hunt the reindeer? <laughs> There's no Christmas this year, motherfuckers. I like how they're hunting. <laughs> they actually like... Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> one walk at here, the other one walk at here. Uh, what's this? Oh, okay, you're like a thingy. We could try to hunt you, I think. Okay, the bear is... Why the donkey's not running away? The stupid ass donkey. Adult female. Yeah, the stupid ass bears are destroying all of the other animals around. Ah, oh, shit. This is really, really not good. I'm gonna run out of food if you're gonna keep doing like this. I need to get the bone weapons and hope that actually I'll be able to take them out. What the hell? A cave lion is attacking my. Oh, you stupid ass bitch. Kill him. You, woman. Oh, you don't have a weapon. That's a child. That's a child. Where are all the men? Good. Okay, you have a weapon. Go! You left this stupid ass corpse over there! No! Oh. What's the mountain lion? Okay, we have bears over here. Don't tell me that they already grew. No, they didn't. Motherfucker! Bloody ass mountain lion decided to come down here and he took my food! Ugh. Oh no, I take it back. There he is. Chase him! Get him! Come back here, you bitch! <laughs> Come on, 12 health. No, you're, you're scaring him away. No, 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 you need a plan. You moron. Go, go, go around. Go around. Go around. There you go. Okay, now he stopped. Oh, he's resting. No. Run! Lion escaped. No, he did not. He, there he is. Go! Go faster. Fa 
I swear to... Oh. Oh, you're out of stamina. That's why you cannot run. Clever girl. Too bad you're not clever enough to actually keep running. And... <laughs> okay, finally, I got one knowledge point so I can get the bone tools. Okay, let's get this thing and maybe... Just maybe I actually be able bone spear, bone harpoon, hunting too. Okay, this thing is a little bit better. So how many bones I have? Four. All right. Then four bloody as bone spears will be made. And winter has come. Okay, we have like a bunch of fish and a little bit of meat, so I should be able to survive through the season. That should not be a problem. I just need to try. Oh, hold on a second. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Shader has arrived. Well, hello. Shader stock. Okay. Dry skins. Bones. Meat. Trade offer. Settlement stock. Value 5. Okay, I've, I've made myself like... Wait, hold on a second. Bone is value 2. I don't have the bone spears over here. Shit. Skins outfit. I can make skin outfit, right? So that's 10. Letter. Dry skin. From one dry skin, I can make two outfits. Huh. Interesting. So if I'm gonna offer you two of those, and you're gonna give me one of this, I'll be able to repro uh, reproduce those things, right? Okay. So I would like to get from you... Hey, you have very cheap food and meat. Okay, that's maybe a little bit too much. There you go. Will this thing work, actually? Okay, I've managed to trade with you. And now, because I took one skin from you, I can create two skins outfit. <laughs> I like this game. <laughs> okay, this is interesting. A pack of wild uh, cave lions decided to come near, next to my settlement. Hold on a second. Pause the game for like a minute. Not this thing. Pause the game. Where are the bears? Hey, the bears retreated. I don't see them anymore. There's only one bear over here. Cave bear, adult mount. Okay. The bloody ass be bears disappeared. The three ones that were like lurking next to my camp. There's only one, like one, one, one over there. But I don't see the the pack of three. Ha! Huh. Apparently, all of my animals disappeared. It's like a pack of animals over here, but that's not much. Okay, this is gonna be problematic, but okay, looks like it's hunting season for mountain lions, boys! So we have one uh, adult one who is like heavily damaged, young one, 54, okay, so take out the young ones first and the, uh, the hearted one, and after that, we have to pray. <laughs> I don't know what this thing actually works, so... Let's see, I have the bone spears, right? So they should give me like a little bit bigger damage. Hey, where are you going? No, 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 no. Hey! Oh. Okay, hunt this one then. Ow. Okay, one down. Where do you think you're going? No, 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 no. You're not going anywhere, bitches. You're going right into my storage room. Okay, hunt this one. Come on. Aha! Okay, now this one. Ha <laughs> ha! Easy mode. Oh, new people has arrived. You want to join me? All, f like, four of you? Ooh. Okay, that's gonna be a difficulty. Okay, kids, move. You're gonna help with transporting the food. Ah, two people? No, four people joined the settlement. Okay. Right. I have a... Uh, um, hey, why are you all enter at one tent? <laughs> Get out of there! Uh, okay, you need to get some proper clothing first. So craft me some clothing. Okay, you're gonna go around and you're gonna help with transportation of the resources. Come on, guys. Move on, people! We have food to transport around. And it started to snow in the valley, and because those morons came here without proper clothing, they're gonna all freeze to death. How wonderful. Really bloody great. Okay, what's the other mountain lion? Ah, there you are, sweetheart. No, it's not you. There's the one. Okay, that's actually two of them. Okay, we're gonna hunt you down as well. Don't you move? There you go. This is what you get for crawling too close to my settlement, bitch! <laughs> the brave hunters return from the hunt with skins and food for the settlement to survive the winter. 
we almost ended the winter actually, so that's cool. And uh, the people who have joined me recently, I don't know where they are. Oh, here they are. Still without proper clothing. Okay, the skins are drying out, so soon I'll be ha I will have like resources to actually make myself like a uh, like some more clothing, hopefully for those people. All right, so I think this is actually a good point to cut this episode over here. It has been the hunting season for the village that I have no idea what to call it. In the next episode, uh, I think we're gonna try to maybe make get some dogs and maybe get some religion, you know? I don't know, we're gonna see. Let me know what you think about this game, let me know what you actually want to see. Uh, anything else? No, I don't think so. So thank you guys so much for watching, we hope you enjoyed. If you liked the episode, please subscribe a lot, and see you all in the next video.